goes both ways. So when you have to give criticism or critical feedback, that can sometimes make employees feel defensive. And it may feel awkward for you to deliver, especially if it's colleagues you've worked for a long time. But giving that feedback is just as important to be done on a near term. Again, not waiting for the next one-on-one -on -one, or honestly even worse for a formal performance review because no one should ever be surprised. And we'll talk about that. But people should be hearing what that feedback is and hear it in a way that is not open to interpretation. Sometimes you may hear the saying of a compliment sandwich where you say something nice, you say something critical, and you end with a, you know, a, a nice piece of bread on the end. So it may be, hey, Ashley, um, gosh, you've been you know, really firing all cylinders lately. You know, that being said, this one project, uh, you know, there are probably some tweaks to it, but uh, you know, I know you tried hard, and so you know, thank you for doing that. There may have been a really glaring error in a deliverable that I gave, or there may, may be a change that I'm gonna be working on that multiple times, and I really need to know that. But if you tell me that, I walk away from that conversation thinking, hey, they appreciate what I've done. I certainly don't have an idea about a specific change I should be making. So when I say don't make it open to interpretation is that employees should understand what that looks like. Oftentimes that might be sitting side by side. Hey, let's talk through it. So that might mean you telling in the moment, hey, there's some changes that I, I, I'd like to talk through or some feedback I wanna give on a few points. Let's talk about those in our next one-on-one. -on -one. Again, there's times that everything doesn't have to be attacked on all, all sides, but you've planted that flag that you're gonna have that conversation in your next one-on-one -on -one if it needs to wait. Or if something's urgent, it needs to be turned around. Hey, let's set up some time so I can just quickly walk you through this and give feedback. We can talk about it more in the one-on-one, -on -one, but you know, I want to talk through that this week so I don't just make the changes and you know, we, we don't ever talk about it. But you can always plant that flag at least to let people know about that. Because what can feel really awful is if someone feels like they've gotten complimented sandwich through the year and then they get a bad performance rating. And they're like, wait, I don't understand. All of this sounds like a surprise. But having that conversation in a respectful way, uh, but also uh, that it is not open to interpretation so it's clear, can be really impactful for what that employee is going to do in their career, what they're going to do for the business, which is going to reflect on you, and how your relationship can evolve.